students welcome to the science class in the last video we have already done the chapter of world of animals that is chapter number 3 from your science book now today we are going to do exercise from the same chapter exercise a b c d and e so we are going to do these exercises today so now it's exercise time. Let's start. So A. Take the correct answer. Take the correct answer. So we have already done in other subjects how to take the correct answers. There are several options given students. There are several options given. So you are going to first select the correct option. Tick on the boxes just beside that and then you are going to write here the correct answer and fill in the blanks this is the exercise part is from your book you can see from chapter number 3 exercise time page number 18 and 19 let's start students so number a a exercise take the correct answer so we are going to first select the correct answer, tick beside it, beside the boxes and then write here. Let's start with number 1. We see dash kinds of animals around us. So the options number A same, number B different, number C both A and B. So what will be the right answer? So students, does we see same kind of animals around us? No. Does we see different? Yes. So different will be the right answer. So we are going to tick here. And then we are going to write here different. Why? Because number B option is correct. So we put a tick mark on the box, green box. And then we are going to write here what is the answer so it will be we see different kinds of animals around us let's write different first see students i have completed writing that completes the sentence in a correct form we see different kinds of animals around us easy let's do number two domestic animals live in dash a. Jungle B. House C. Water Next come to Options A. Jungle B. House C. Water So students we have already learned where does the domestic animals live Does they live in jungle Does they live in house or Does they live in water so the correct option will be house so let's tick here beside house correct option and then write here in the blanks and we should write house inside the blank that completes the sentence so the answer is domestic animals live in house Number 3. Amphibians live dash. Where does amphibians live? We have already read. Let's see the options. A. On land. B. In water. C. Both A and B means both on land and in water. So where does amphibians live? Amphibians are like frogs. So they live both in on land and in water. So this will be the correct option number C. So we are going to tick here. And we are going to write both on land and in water. So we have written the answer that is amphibians live both on land and in water. Number 4. Most birds can dash. A. Run. B. Fly C. Swim So, there are most birds who can fly Yes 
तो fly is the correct answer. Number B option is the correct option. So we are putting a tick mark on the green box here, and then we are going to write here the option where we have marked it correct. So we are going to write fly. F L Y. So now it completes the sentence correctly. Most birds can fly. Number five. The dash is the national animal of our country. So which is the national animal of our country? Students, here you make the correction. It will be bird. National bird. Because see the options, they are all written bird's name. Okay. So number A, parrot. Is parrot a national bird? No. B, peacock. Is peacock a national bird? Yes. So B, peacock is the correct option. So we have marked tick here, and we are going to write here peacock. What is the spelling? P E A. C O C K, peacock. So the peacock is the national bird of our country. That completes exercise A from your book. Now we come to exercise B. Now students, B exercise tells us what to do. Fill in the blanks. So here we have several options in the yellow box. Okay. Now we are going to write. We are going to choose the correct options from here, and we are going to fill in the blanks. Let's start with number one. All birds lay dash. What does birds lay, students? Lay eggs. Yes. All bird lay eggs. So we are going to write. Eggs here. So we are done with this option. Number two, a dash is a water bird. So which is a water bird? Which bird swim can swim on water? Beak is beak a bird? No. Duck. Does duck swim on water? Yes. So duck is a water bird. So we are going to write duck here. What is the spelling? D U C K. A duck is a swimming bird, or is a water bird. Number three. All birds have a dash to eat with. So, students, we are done with two options. We will tick here as well. So now next, all birds have a dash to eat with. Does bird has any mouth? And what is it called? Beak. Yes, beak. So beak is the correct option. B e a k. So all birds have a beak to eat with. Next, number four. Fish. Have dash on their body. Do you know what does fish have on their body? There are two options left. What will be the correct options? Is this one the correct options? No. Is this one the correct options? Scales? Yes. So we will tick here, and we are going to write scales. So fish have scales on their Body. Number five. Wings and feathers help a bird to dash. What does wings and feathers help a bird to fly? Okay, bird can fly with the help of wings and feathers. So fly is the correct option. So we write here fly. F L Y. So wings and feathers help a bird to fly. And thus, we are done with exercise B. So we are done with exercise A. Take the correct answer, and we are done with exercise B. Fill in the blanks. So students, we are done with.
with exercise A and B that is take the correct answers and fill in the blanks. Learn all these answers from exercise A and B that we have already solved the worksheets. Write it, say and write, learn all these answers properly and don't make the book untidy. Thank you students. Bye.